All right, guys, uh, this video is to show you how to take a battery off a MacBook Pro. Uh, I saw a lot of videos on YouTube. Uh, however, most of them were like really, really complicated, just having like drops of uh, alcohol put over here and then you kind of rotate the, the MacBook, making it, uh, you know, making the glue underneath kind of dissolve and then you pull the battery out, which is like more than like half an hour process. And in the, in, in the process, you kind of end up you know, uh, damaging your touchpad. Uh, well, I came up with my own indigenous solution. <laughs> I don't know how much indigenous it is, <laughs> but basically I use a thread, right? And the thread is uh, essentially a nylon thread, very, very strong. It's really hard to break. Uh, we, we, I mean, it's, it's used for multiple purposes. You can get it on Home Depot or Lowe's or uh, any other place which has plumbing supplies or uh, electricals. I think uh, this is probably, uh, I think an all-purpose thread that I got. Uh, not, not expensive, very cheap. Um, and uh, so basically what you do is uh, you have to uh, put this thread underneath the battery one by one. Uh, this battery I've already worked on. I did that just to test my solution and it works. Uh, or one more thing is that you basically, to take the battery out of the MacBook Pro, you have to peel off this uh, piece of sticker that's up there. And then there are two screws. One is right here. One is right here and also you need to unplug your battery so that's how that is done uh, these two batteries I think are, are free to move uh, um, I think there's underneath the plate which can come out and these are the two batteries that have to be uh, unglued so let's try that so just to give you an, a, a sample of what I did it's essentially uh, taking the, the, the thread and pushing it underneath the battery here uh, let's do this, and then here, I think I have almost got it, so here, right, and you also put it from the other side on this place, here, and then all you do is basically push and pull, push and pull, push and pull, and it will cut the tape underneath, right, and now you see that my battery is kind of moving up, um, so here. So don't, I don't think, uh, I'm not, I don't know if this, uh, what all other things are sticking underneath, but what I'm going to do is try to pry all four batteries open and then, um, I, I don't know, it's just going to pull out, I think. Uh, so let's finish uh, the, the prying out. All right, so this is the second battery that I'm going to pull out. All right, this corner looks good. I will tighten it so it doesn't come off easily. And then I'm gonna do the other corner. All right, here it goes underneath. Uh, I will have somebody else hold the, the, the laptop so you hold it nice and tight. Uh, also, one thing that you put a cloth underneath, I don't want your laptops to get scratched and then you guys cursing me. Uh, so it's, uh, by the way, it's, this video is just for, uh, informational purposes. The risks are all your own. So do not blame me if you blow up your laptop or you get, these batteries are highly explosive uh, or, um, you know, inflammable. If you puncture it, uh, or, you know, they, you compress it or things like that. It's a lithium ion battery. It can catch fire. So please be careful. All right. Um, I will have you hold it from here cause I'm going to pull this, uh, hold it from here. Okay. Yeah. Uh, keep your fingers here, ma. Okay. All right. So here I'm starting. Oh, see, so it's it's cutting the glue. Uh, all right. Take this hand off. Take this hand off. All right. I've cut this glue and almost there. Oh, good. See, this battery just came off. Ooh, that works. That is awesome. I'm gonna do the same, and it's just like a minute's job versus you know you putting uh, the alcohol in there, drops of alcohol, and then trying to uh, uh, you know pry open the batteries, and that's gonna take like half an hour or more. Some some people have uh, damaged their touch pads, so this is an easier way. Um, I hope uh, you know this helps you uh, for all those whose batteries are right now uh, you know above their charge cycles of thousand. Because uh, MacBooks recommended charge cycles are thousand uh, uh, charges per per battery. Um, 
all right i have this and then i have got this all right i have it here i'm going to pull that again so with my thread i hope you guys can see it um here one uh it's kind of painful pulling the thread of course so <clears throat> two three all right, cool. That was easy. Um, finally, the fourth battery. I'm gonna do that now. Um, yeah. All right. Just gonna make sure that the cord is snug in the corner, and then I'm gonna do the other corner. Push it in. Then, nope. All right, it's in. So let's do the fourth battery now. One, two. Oh man, this is painful. Cool. That's really easy. No sweat. <laughs> Alright, let's see what it takes to pull them out. So, now that this is out, I do not think that will be a big job to pull them out. Uh, let me see what's underneath these guys. I don't know. It doesn't seem to have anything holding it underneath, uh, but I guess there are lots of videos out there that help uh, tell you how to, uh, um, you know, uh, remove the batteries. Uh, let's see if this guy comes out. Mm, nope. For some reason, it's stuck. Just gonna try to pull it out. All right, guys, I got to look up some information on how to actually pull batteries out once they're unglued. I know that there's a plate underneath. Uh, I hope this video helped you out. Uh, if you did like the video, <laughs> I, won't, I, don't know, I won't ask you to subscribe because I don't uh, put a lot of views on YouTube. Uh, but do put in your comments. Uh, it'll be nice to read what, if this uh, solution helped anybody or not. Uh, take care. Thank you. And, and be careful while pulling out the batteries. Thank you. Bye.